Rocket, Rocket the Iguana. Just wanted to talk to y'all today about some of the uh, pros and cons about owning iguanas. To me, uh, it's hard to think of cons because they're such great animals. But you know, to keep it real, they do have some uh, downsides. Uh, but you know, we'll start with the good things first. To me, the best thing about owning an iguana is, uh, is just that owning this great animal, you know? It's like you have your own little baby dinosaur uh, that you get to see grow, you know, and have his own personality. Wander around your house, you know, it's, um, it's something that you can take pride in. Like, you know, a lot of your friends and family members may be scared of it or they may think it's cool, which is uh, pretty cool both ways with me. You know, I like having pets that other people don't like having, you know what I'm saying? That makes me feel that much more, you know, braver than a person that's scared to have an iguana. Yeah, man, they're real great. They, uh, they're interesting. And just to, to elaborate on the personality part, like, you know, no two iguanas are the same. Like, they all act different. That's why it's kind of uh, hard to tell people certain things about their iguana because theirs may be way different than yours. And Rocket, you know, Rocket is a pretty mild-mannered iguana. I never had too many uh, problems with him, you know, except for you no, know, we'll get into that on the con part. But for the most part, Rocket is pretty calm. He's cool, he's funny. You know, Rocket be tripping. Like, y'all see, if y'all ain't following the TikTok, make sure y'all follow the TikTok. Rocket, he's always into things.
they make great companions. Like, uh, it's never a dull moment when you have an iguana that's uh, comfortable with you and uh, like to uh, let you hold him and like to be out with you. But like I said, there's also some cons to own an iguana. Like for instance, the number one thing is mating season. When you got a male iguana and he's in his mating season, he's gonna probably hate you. can't express that enough, like they could be dangerous when it's mating season. Another one of the cons to me is uh, you're gonna always be shopping for your iguana. Whether you're in a grocery store buying fruits and vegetables, or if you're in a local pet store buying supplies, you know, it's a never ending thing. But to me, the pros outweigh the cons. So as you can see, he's getting squirmy here. And uh, we'll end it on that note, because he want to do his own thing. I guess he want to go back in the enclosure. But yeah, bunch of pros, bunch of cons of owning iguanas. And not a pet for everybody, but if you're patient, uh, you're brave, it's definitely a pet that you might get some joy out of. Thank y'all for watching. Till next time. Peace.